he said, if Tim is not doing this, like like how Jordan said, if Phil Jackson's not doing this, I'm out. I'm not doing this shit no more. So Michael is a huge Tim Burton. He he's a Tim all the way through. He said, if Tim is not doing this, I'm not doing this. When they wanted to do Batman, neither of them should have done this. They asked him to do. You're it. late. Yeah. Hey, this is hey. I'm be, I'm being honest. The movie coming out, cool. That's fine. I, this teaser ain't. This shit ain't. Uh, uh, this is a teaser that doesn't t say nothing. Oh, he's coming back. It, I, we got that in the announcement trailer yeah, or the announcement okay. article that we talked about. We already talked about this. And I learned nothing from this teaser at all. Like, okay, Beetlejuice is back. I do, I'm sure yeah, I, like, I, you I'm gotta not going to lie. I would definitely story. love to show me something. You got to make a whole story yeah. from 30 something years ago to stay relevant now to where people will buy it. That's going to be hard. This right here, bro, is crazy. Michael Keaton came back to play Batman in the Flash movie. And I didn't think that was ever going to happen. And it was epic, bro. Mm -hmm. And he, I never in a million years thought that he would have come back and bring Beetlejuice back. Like, Beetlejuice? I'm still shocked my damn self, but... Michael. Of all the things, Beetlejuice redone with Michael Keaton let's check this shit out this is Beetlejuice 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 the official trailer Holy it's trailer. showtime shake 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 Lenora emo girl dark hair been a long time too. You play as a uh, Wednesday. Wow. Juice is loose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, hold on. Let me see his face. Freak that. You can go do that. Wow. He don't look the same. He's older. Didn't Beetlejuice always look old and yeah, raggedy? Yeah, he did. He did. He did. He did. It don't look like the same like I remember him. He did. Yeah. It's about a little bit. Uh, E-Man, you are the fan. I'm a huge fan. I wish this movie would have came out a long time ago, though, when he was young. Um, But since we're going to get this now, which I was still surprised because I thought it was the end. I mean, how they ended it was... But I think it's fantastic, bro. I, I, I love to see Michael Keaton. I'm a huge Michael Keaton fan. Um, I would like to know what they're going to do with this because for the end of it, Beetlejuice went down. He died again. And you know what I'm saying? The, the voodoo man put the put the sauce on him and his head was like little living like this. You know what I'm saying? So, whoa, whoa, what are we doing here? Uh, I can't be late to you think. So I would love to see what they're doing with this. I, um, I think it's fantastic. I would love to see who is her husband what what happened from that how the father i think that's i think that's the father who died i would like to find out what happened with that and is alec baldwin in this movie and i forgot the other chick uh i forgot her name but i wonder if she's this movie too because i would love to see them at the same time because they were ghosts you know see they passed it was happening what's going on so yeah i think it's good i think it's dope is there something wrong with michael keaton is he like broke no Everybody wants to see Michael in more shit. Michael Keaton has spent his entire career dodging certain roles, dodging Batman, dodging, putting himself in, in movies. And then he had a resurgence later in his career where it's like, all right, let me be in movies now. And it's like weird, like, bro, like, like you've wasted a lot of your career not being in movies. And now here we are, you, so, 30 years later, you're doing Beetlejuice. So and Tim Burton, he was waiting for Tim Burton. 
he said, if Tim is not doing this, like like how Jordan said, if Phil Jackson's not doing this, I'm out. I'm not doing this shit no more. So Michael is a huge Tim Burton. He he's a Tim all the way through. He said, if Tim is not doing this, I'm not doing this. When they wanted to do Batman, neither of them should have done this. They asked him to do. You're it. late. Yeah. Hey, this is hey. I'm be, I'm being honest. The movie coming out, cool. That's fine. Uh, this teaser ain't shit. This shit ain't, uh, uh, this is a teaser that doesn't t say nothing. Oh, he's coming back. It, I we got that in the announcement trailer yeah, or the announcement okay. article that we talked about. We already talked about this, and I learned nothing from this teaser at all. Like, okay, Beetlejuice is back. I do, I'm sure I'll like, you I'm gotta make a whole story. Love to show me something. You I gotta make a whole story yeah. from 30 something years ago to stay relevant now to where people will buy it. That's gonna be hard. And a lot of people don't know who Peter Juice is either. What do you think would happen if Nightmare Before Christmas came out now? A lot of people wouldn't be on it because they don't know about it. Blah. Yeah, they don't, don't know nothing about it. My Nightmare Before Christmas, which is iconic. Fire! If it came out now, it would flop. Because a, a lot of kids a, don't it, know shit about it's it. It's a time, it's, it's, yeah. a, it's of its time. Yeah. Tim Burton is a man of his time, and it seems like Michael Keaton was trying to be a man of his time until recently. I don't know, bro. I don't think that I'm. Well, I would say this. I thing. don't think that Michael was still doing. This, other I feel stuff, like this though, is but, a waste know. of Michael Keaton's talent. You think so? Yeah, I do. I think a lot of fans. Some. What you think, Sam? Um, when I went to the local park to watch a film. This Halloween, they showed Nightmare Before Christmas to all the kids in the park. And the kids had fun and they liked it. I think that this is one of those Christmas movies. Night Tim Burton is one of those guys like Wes Anderson. He has a loyal following. Not with that release date. Not with a September release date. I understand Halloween. That's freaking September. When school comes back. September? I agree with that. September. Uh, Bring I that shit uh, in uh, Halloween. Yeah, Halloween. I would understand been, a Halloween yeah, or Christmas. Yeah. September. Not Christmas, but Halloween. Yeah, I, I could do that. Still cosplay and dress up because I saw one or two. I saw a few Beetlejuice. I did this too. Year. I did too. I did too last, last year. Let so, me yeah. tell you the big. Let me tell you the big thing that that we might not be watching for. Um. So Winona was there, right? Yep. Yeah, she was. Yeah, she yeah, came yeah. Back. That's a big deal. Look good. Winona. Too. With Stranger Things has a, had a good run. She's hotter. She's just as hot as she's ever been. Stranger Things worked for her. And then they brought in heavy hitter, the Hollywood new it girl, Wednesday Adams. Yep, yep. From and her show well. is fire. I think. So fire, yep. I think that Wednesday's new season probably starts around September. And she's the draw for kids everywhere because all the emo kids love her. She's yep. number yep. one right now. That's facts. So, so Beetlejuice might be second fiddle. And they've been trying. I'm sure they've been telling him every three years. Somebody asking to play Beetlejuice. Come on, man. You know, and like you said, maybe that mortgage getting up there. Money getting low. I don't know. But. Um, this isn't the type of movie that you just revitalize it in, in the in your golden years, right? This is something that you do ten years after the fact, maybe six, but 20, 30, 30? years later. Yeah. What was Tim? What and was then Tim? you hear Michael Keaton says, "I said no." Oh, he's he's denied this for fifteen years. Yeah, you saw the video that we yes, watched. Yeah, he's he denied he it. it it's yeah. like another eight yeah. years from now, yeah. ten years from now. This is a movie. Harrison Ford comes back as Han Solo in. 2032. Well, he did come but back that, as an old ass that's man. Welcome, though. <laughs> he didn't do Solo shit. coming back, that's tight. He didn't do shit. Got How many killed. people want Beetlejuice to come, Michael Keaton to come back as Beetlejuice? No, he, he did Batman. That was great. That was this. They got the Ghostbusters money coming in. They're like, bro, you leaving all this on the table? Bill Mary, yeah. Bill, you... Bill Mary came back for her to play. Uh... I forgot to drop my Ghostbusters review. Freak. The whole day was over, too. Freak. You got to go. All right, y'all. After Damn. the stream is over, I'm dropping it. Yeah, I'm gonna drop it tonight, right after the stream. All right, so y'all and gotta, not just anime.com is getting the episodes too. So y'all can enjoy y'all y'all weekend. Y'all have a new <sighs> new review tonight. At least yeah. we advertise it right yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But so I'm glad I brought that up. I but, spent I spent freaking an hour and a half editing that shit. Damn. You edit it yourself. Yeah. I thought you would have put that out already. I thought you was going to that That's a rip. Today. That's a rip. I was busy all day today. <laughs> he said, that's a rip. That's a rip. <laughs> the granddaughter discovering him all over you again. You think she's going to outshine him? 
I sure hope not. It's called Beetlejuice. But I could see it happening. I saw the older woman. I saw Winona Ryder. And I saw a little girl. That was, I didn't see, like you said, Alec Baldwin or any men. Yeah, yeah, I saw yeah. three women. And then the juice is loose. And the funny thing that Jody said that really had me cracking up was, yeah, Beetlejuice is back. We knew that because the movie's called Beetlejuice. You know what I mean? So, yeah, yeah, they didn't give us the juices on the loose, which is funny. But, uh, I, I, you know, I'm there day one. Same. Nah. Same. If, if, if the stream goes off, I don't have to be there day one. But I'll probably be there with these guys. Yeah, we're def we but, definitely going to go see that. But guess yeah, what? Yeah. Guess what? I don't need it Thursday. If I saw, if I saw it Thursday... Is it a must so you could get a review Friday. Is it a must -see? I could wait Sunday, a you week or two. A lot of people will wait to streaming. Mm -hmm. That's because they fucking trash. They don't know shit about and Beetlejuice, they did. bro. Beetlejuice hasn't been out in 30 years. I just watched Beetlejuice A whole last generation night, bro. of people have fire. been birthed. How much do you think it's going to make? See, you got Michael Keaton. We saw how much The Flash made with Michael Keaton as Batman. His greatest role. If he was, if that boy, if that motherfucker wasn't in there, it would have made more. If they would have, if if they never would have picked two, they never would have picked Ezra Miller. It would have made more. We know why it went bad because Ezra Miller. Let's get that shit straight. And how they did it, but um, Michael Keaton and you got the girl from Wednesday. Uh, I would say. Six hundred million. You crazy out your goddamn mind. What the <laughs> That motherfucker that's <laughs> said, He said Dune. Dune two money. Bro. Who don't said that? He said six hundred million. Who? I did. That motherfucker. Ooh. I did. Do you know hey, what divide Dune that by two? Maybe. That's a huge success. I mean, One fifty million? I okay. think this might be yeah 180 total global worldwide. I'm googling when does Wednesday There's a lot of season people two come out who like when the actress and people who like Michael Keaton. Keaton ain't just small fry, bro. But what Jody was looking at, you can't discard yeah, that okay. it drops in September. Yeah, it should, what I, I, big I, movies come out in September? They right before Halloween. Yeah, you look the same. You look the same. They right before Halloween and right before Christmas. They don't trust it as a Christmas movie. When did the first Beetlejuice come out? I'll Google that for y'all after this. I agree with you though about the Halloween part. That would have been dope for for uh, Beetlejuice to come out on that. Halloween or Christmas? Yeah, not Christmas. Why not? Christmas Tim is Burton, more of a holiday. Tim is more a of that. Yeah, but that's that, guy. Yeah, that Tim that's, Burton has Halloween and Christmas. That's what he does. He makes Halloween movies during Christmas, Christmas but Beetlejuice is not a Christmas. Christmas type of movie. Beetlejuice is more of a neither is the Halloween. Nightmare Before Christmas. Nightmare Before Christmas, fire though. But that that's more yeah that that, that you could do it for Halloween or Christmas because it's called the Nightmare Before Christmas, so you could go with that. Tim Burton's Batman Returns took place during what time? Uh, was it ninety seven? What season was it? Uh, I don't remember. You don't remember when Michelle Pfeiffer and Batman? I don't remember the like Minnesota? like. You don't remember Michelle Pfeiffer and Batman kissing under the... Oh, yeah, Christmas. It was Christmas. It was Christmas yeah, everywhere. Yeah, Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He loves Christmas. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Or Halloween. Yeah, that, that, that thing. That That's thing who Tim Burton yeah. is. The dark yeah. Christmas. And he ain't got neither one. Yeah, that that's bad. I'll give you that. That's an L. That's an L on that one. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. The date is an L. 600 million? Yeah. Freak. They're not announcing yeah. Jenna Ortega's Wednesday season two release date on Netflix. So. But if it comes out in September, that would make sense to me. That's tough. All right, man. Y'all let me know what you guys think in the comment section. That's what's up. Oh, somebody donated. What am I doing for free? Albert Choice, man. Shout out to this man, Albert Choice. We got to highlight this man. That's what we got to do, bro. All right, Albert. Let me go ahead and scroll up so we can see you here. Albert Choice said, shout out to Sad E-Man and of course hey. Jody Joe. Hey, shout out to you, dog. And oh, shoot out to the king. Shout out to the king. T'Challa. <laughs> shout out to you. <laughs> T'Challa. Albert, man, thank you for joining Discord and talking to me last time or two as well. You tight, bro. 
greatly appreciate the love man everybody let me know in the chat what you guys think am i being like too like hard on it like knowing that like i feel like that time is coming gone i don't really think that it's beetlejuice time um, especially after that teaser that teaser ain't getting nobody excited people a couple of people i, I say nobody because i don't mean everybody well you did say uh, you did say they show too much in trailers this is just showing him don't show that at all just drop the movie then show one trailer give me i I feel like this should have been an official full trailer. You show said they show too much in trailers, though. They show too, way too much in the trailer. You want them to show everything in the trailer? In this trailer? I understand that you want to defend it because Beetlejuice is like your childhood hero. And you love it very much. I do love when it. When I say they show too much in trailers, because they show too many trailers. Right, right, right. I always said one official trailer is all you need for every movie. Just one. And this is a teaser. A trailer is going to come after this, he man. Yeah. yeah. I just feel like this ain't teasing anything. Oh, there he is in a suit. Oh, for, oh, she's in it. Oh, these are for the, this is for the people that don't know Beetlejuice. This is for the people that don't know movies. This is for the people that's like, oh, oh, oh let's see. Uh, bro, I need to see a full trailer to get me to want to go see it. You, you, it, Beetlejuice is not as big as they think it is. They had toys, they had cereal, they had a cartoon. cartoon for a None long of this stuff time. the kids have seen. And out of a one minute trailer, yeah. we got about three seconds of Michael Keaton. A teaser out of that one minute. Two. All right, can, as we wrap this up, Two put, it, put in the chat theater or streaming. Just, just gauge it for y'all. But do our parents, do they have to take their kids to see this? Is Absolutely this a must? Not. I think most most parents i don't think would even know that this is for kids or kids can see it just by looking at it there are parents that don't know who beetlejuice is huh yeah 22 year old parents 23 year old parents? 23 25 28 when did beetlejuice come out uh 80 what when did beetlejuice come out how would someone have to be if they were born when beetlejuice came out i'll do it i'll he, i'm fascinating trash All right, Beetlejuice. Is this like a Beastie right Boys here. album? I wouldn't say that. LL Cool J, new album. 18, 1988. You're mm. 35, 36. You're 35, 36 years. Nick, that was, oh, that was almost, that was 36 years ago. Shout out for Winona for I, still I think being this, current. Yeah, you know I mean, yeah, I think this though, bro. The movies that we have, that's come, that some of the movies that come out these new age, these new shit. Some of them be whack, bro. Do you know but that the that, classics was better? Do you the know style, that? the way they did it? Yeah, a lot yeah, of shit I, that they did I'm now. A lot of stuff that. they got the technology I'm not, I'm is trash. That. I'm not arguing that. So this movie coming out, bringing bringing back the nostalgia, bringing back some real shit, showing people what film's supposed to do, bro. Like somebody who is 30 right now has never seen Beetlejuice because they were not live. You could be 30 years old and miss Beetlejuice by six years. You got to be 36 years old to have been born. So that means you got to be like 46 and up. To really appreciate Beetlejuice, because that means you had to be born in like 78. So you were like 10 years old when Beetlejuice came out, so you know about Beetlejuice. Mm. That's not of even the last generation. This is not a millennial movie. This is the boomer? What's after, uh, what's before millennials? Boomer, Gen right? Oh. Gen, Z Gen Z. Gen X. Gen X. Gen X. Gen X? This is a Gen X. Here's a little sum sum for you. People who are 45 and 50 already have kids who got kids. But that's the that's why they got Jenna Ortega in there because her fan base is that 20 something yeah, year old. Yeah. He's 10 years. Is this her first movie? Late. Probably. Uh no. She she's about to do um Scream. The next Scream movie, I believe. Uh-uh. That's not true, he's even. 10 years. Are you too telling late. me Scream is gonna be out before this? I think so. Oh snap, Evil! He hey. just gifted 10 Jody's Corner subscriptions to the community. Whoa, that's what I'm talking about, Evil. Wow, look at the new members. Hold on, hold on, hold on. 
Thanks to Evo's amazing generosity, we have 10 new members of Jody's Corner who will also be able to watch this entire stream uncut in its entirety after it airs on YouTube. It is Marcus F., Ramon Carter, Anime God, Richie Rich, Game Over, Jordan Landers, Cable, Brandon Bryce, what's that last one there? And Cameron 187 them. Shout out to you, bro. All you guys are members. Welcome to Jody's Goddamn Corner. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to be a hater. I'm just being real.